Alright, hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are going to be playing some more Hoop Central 6. Well, actually, we're not going to be playing Hoop Central 6. A lot of leaks have came out recently on the Discord. And, you know, I didn't really have a video for today. So, I might as well record this video so I can just get today out of the way. And trust me, tomorrow and Wednesday, you are definitely going to have a build video two new builds that you guys have never seen before but for right now this video i'm just gonna keep show some leaks that have recently been posted in the discord so yeah let's go all right guys right here for our first leak we actually have a quick little seven second video so i'm gonna bring this over here recorded by the devs and they say you will soon be able to grind attributes as well as get more than three slots that being a game pass but this video is going to be showing us that soon we will be able to grind attributes aka grind stats aka raising our overall so we can become a better player now let's play this video but, but before we play this video as we can see on the screen already we have a point guard sharpshooter deadeye and it shows us all of the stats without having to go into a my player and create your own build it shows all of the stats right here which is amazing so we can check we we can check whenever we need to know something or to see if how high our overall is and see how much better we've gotten but let's play this video as you can see he switches to center defender as you can see the stats have changed obviously the stats are going to change between builds next he's going to switch again to a small forward point forward lockdown stats have changed and to power forward slasher lockdown stats have changed this is a really good change pretty much what this is just going to do is just show us our stats and we can check our stats whenever we want to now on to the next leap all right, now for the next leak, I'm going to bring my whole Discord over and click on this. City Park will be in a bigger update, not laggy. Not being able to lag is going to be so good because right now, Hoop Central 6 is filled with all of these different regions, with all this lag, all these glitches, all these bugs, and it is incredibly annoying. Us good players at the game we lose our big streaks 30 40 50 60 70 80 100 plus just to some glitches and bugs which is extremely annoying and we have to pay 75 robux to revive that streak so hopefully this the in the future update that will fix that but anyways on to the city park okay this is the screenshot right here full view as you can see i'm pretty sure the devs have it on max graphics right now you can see the fog in the background the fog in the background only happens with max graphics now we're not gonna play with max graphics i'm sure you guys are not gonna play with max graphics just to save us the lag and game freezing so anyway let's move on to the scenery as you can see we have some trees right here lots and lots and lots of lamp posts all right got a little street right here where we can walk all of these buildings in the background just adding to the aesthetic of the park you can walk into the park there's fences all around the park there's green which i think is going to be 1v1 red which i think is going to be 2v2 and blue the big full court ones which is going to be 3v3 all right now here's another screenshot we are a lot more closer to the buildings and a lot more closer to the grass you can really 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 see the amount of effort they put into the, these trees because these trees are highly detailed and this grass is nice you can see the little raindrops on the street as well which just makes the game a lot more soothing and pleasant to look at we have all these buildings back here stores lit up by these uh light poles and inside and the game and park just looks absolutely amazing anyways enough at look in the park let's take a look at our own new private gym first thing that i notice is all of these beautiful pastel colors in the background 
absolutely love those all the skylights the lights on the top lights on the bottom lights on the floor and of course the backboards that are floating in the middle of the room just like season two had absolutely amazing isn't no stand it's just straight up floating it looks like we got a second floor too and an elevator i mean i don't really know why we would need an elevator maybe for some trick shots of course you got the three ball rack that had that you can pick up unlimited balls and i'm pretty sure you could also type bb and hopefully in this gym you can actually run games because in the season two gyms it would be like slash team new red and nothing would work like it would not work you would have to keep track of the score yourself and it was highly annoying so i want it to be just like rb world 4 where there are settings in the gym and we can run straight pickup games right from the settings all right, we are back here in Discord, and now let's take a look at something else. Updated player cards. Now, in the future update, this is what the player cards are going to look like. I am King Map, Sharpshooter, Deadeye, Small Forward, 99. So, it is going to show your position right here. It is going to show you your build and your grand badge. It is going to show you your rank. It's going to show your username right here. And, of course, it's going to show you your overall right here. It is a pretty clean player card because as i switch back to the game right now this is our current player card i mean it does show our name it shows our position our build and our grand badge it doesn't but it doesn't show our overall just like this one does and this one is just a lot more cleaner and of course you can see your rank but here you can't so the new player card is really nice i like it i like it but now we are going to be moving on to the new and improved grand badges starting off we have a playmaker grand badge image how are we looking okay so straight off we have diamond gold silver and bronze all right diamond gold silver and bronze now straight off we can all tell that this badge is going to be used for a playmaker more specifically a playmaker facilitator because facilitators are really good at breaking ankles and to add on to my facilitators the the devs posted all of the grand badges down here now grand badges will be grindable grindable from bronze to diamond now we're gonna start off at the top first grand badge as you can see it is dead eye right here second grand badge is going to be lockdown for defensive players third grand badge is going to be moving specialist for shot creators fourth grand badge is going to be facilitators for playmakers fifth grand badge is going to be skyhook for post scores and finally the sixth grand badge is going to be teardropper for the stretches and slashers and post scores now these are all the grand badges they are very clean i like every single one of them except the moving specialist the moving specialist you know you could it's kind of hard to tell when you first look at it like what it actually is because the player is facing the side now it would look a lot better if the player moved like a 45 degree angle counterclockwise so it would actually face us and know that the the first thing when you look at it it's someone shooting a fade or a moving shot okay now i like all of these grand badges especially this one dead eye this looks absolutely amazing i love what they did with the dead eye lockdown pretty simple all you got to do is just put a lock on it boom means lockdown ankle breaker facilitators playmakers good at ankle breaking sky hook of course good for post scores and teardroppers just made for every, every single center or power forward that plays in the paint all right anyways guys i scrolled all the way down and that was all of the leaks recently now i am very looking forward to this future update hopefully as much as you guys now i saw all the support on my last videos thank you guys so much 
I'm trying to make it out here as a Hoop Central 6 YouTuber. I know that does sound kind of cringe and I just picked up a ball. Let me just green that real quick. All right, anyways, thank you guys for watching. That was all the recent leaks and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.